Ivy with the steal. Beautiful dunk. Jaden Ivy, I'm falling out of my chair. Jaden Ivy taking good defense and making it posterizing offense. Morton getting physical up top with Kate Playcom. Ivy with another steal. He's gonna lay down another one and a windmill dunk. If anyone's looking for a Jaden Ivy poster, you got a couple options to choose from tonight. Shot clock winding down, down to five. Ivy hit the pot. Shota break away. <laughs> Jaden Ivy is having fun tonight. Jaden Ivy, the sophomore, the steal and the slam. It's a program that knows success. It's also Scott Nagy talked to us about this is a tough place for us to find it. What a pass! Here's another look at oh, what he's the one used from to Williams. The double come, it didn't come. Caleb first. What a tremendous cut, find, and finish. And Caleb first, really special player. They are so excited about him here at Purdue. <laughs> Devonovich, good ball fit, uh, buries a three. The foul. Watch how hard Sasha comes off the screen. Shot fake, but watch this, John. Notice that yesterday we watched practice, a lot of sharp ball movement, spacing. Watch out. Oh, look out! Jay Nivey. But he's got the skill to go with it. Now, this is just a drive and showtime. You got to turn him into a two point shooter today. Ivy turns the corner and puts it off the glass and in. Scouting report right there. Watch this drive by Jaden Ivy. This is what we talk about. He's got elite speed to the basket. And this is a Mavericks team that's been shooting only around 31% from three point range in their first five games. Williams going to work. Nice find, and the two-hand jam for Caleb first. Here's Williams working against Brougham, and there's that great dish off to first. Oh, over the shoulder, Ole, and the two-hand jam. If you can get your big guys doing interior passing. Well, Purdue's kept it going in the second half. They've outscored UNO 25 to 11 in the second frame. And still north of 60%. Oh, Look my out. goodness! A reverse one-hand jam for Travion Williams. But Travion Williams, a little up and under for the one-hand jam. Omaha is now four of 24 from three-point range, but the Mavericks are gonna keep plugging. They're gonna keep shooting them. Wow, look at that move by Williams. How did he finish? And then watch this athletic sizzle. Ball with the crossover. What a play for the senior from Chicago. Osborne kicks back out. Shot clock is under 10. Mills at the basket. Ivy to rejection, and Purdue will go the other way. State champs last year. Watch the vision. Oh, great pass! Wow! Yeah. What a look! Well, watch Travion Williams now. He's going to look to the middle of the floor, and he sees it all. Watch this. Boom! Great look. And so, here's Josh Agundale, big freshman or sophomore, I should say. And now, Jared free and taken away. Morton leading the charge over to first. And it rolls in. Look at the defense collapse on Perkins as he's trying to make a move. Watch more. Gets the ball knocked out. He retains it. Gets it over to Caleb first. That would just, hasn't got much from their starters. 20 points from the starters, 23 from the bench. And being down a dozen. Look at Ivy. Oh, my. Take another look. I mean, goes baseline, starts up, and keeps going. <laughs> Jay Nivey, jumper from Kokomo, and landing in Mackey Arena on this move. Now Amori has it taken away. Ivy uncontested. Whoa! Ivy, this is a major league play. He takes this ball, and he is cleared for takeoff. Jaden Ivey going upstairs, throwing down the windmill, and hanging on rims. 
flush the memory of that heartbreaking loss. Good hands. And now Stefanovic with numbers to Williams to the basket. Travion Williams is so long. There's so many guards that come off the ball screen. They think there's no way he can get to this. Those long arms coming in hand Evan from three now, but this is going to help you get that field goal percentage up. The steal by Travion Williams. Sasha Stefanovic leading the break, and Travion Williams going up and throwing it down for the Boilermakers. Maybe he's going to be the one to bring it up. Driving it on more cell blue right by him. Holy cow! to the basket you want to pick Jaden Ivey up 94 feet watch this takes off right to the basket not uncommon that's what Purdue does to just about everybody Ivy count it spoke to Car coach Cunningham this morning I mean this is something that he wants to do he wants to be able to spread the Purdue defense out make shots there's a guy making a shot Jaden Ivey attacking the basket and one of the loudest venues. They get it rolling. Maybe, wow, that'll get it rolling. The most explosive guard in the country. Listen. Check out his speed. Gets to the rim in less than five dribbles with the finish. Defense doesn't even want to jump. They know he's big, he's strong, he's athletic. Anytime he has a full head of steam. There's been so much made about him being simple, whether it's as a passer and as a scorer. Trevion Williams able to get his game on a little bit more. And once again, the ball goes inside. The post double comes. Here's Zach Eady, and this is him being efficient. Two dribbles. The post double comes late on the rotation. Sachs to five. They do bounce it in there late in the shot clock. Eady going to work. Great spin move, and he got it. Start doing that. Threes can start falling, but this is a big time move. Crowd doesn't want to foul. Edie understanding that going right to the basket. It has been, all things considered, just a, an impressive job for Greg Gard and his crew. So now Travion Williams going to throw a baseball pass down to Edie. Boy, well, that was well executed. Holy cow. I, you know, Brandon, forget your three. <laughs> when you can get a two that, that takes you one second, I, I guess you'll take it. Yeah, that's the one exception for how quickly you can get a two rather than shoot it from outside the arc. And now Edie with a new career height. Purdue has won the last four, played inside this venue, including the last three in overtime. But now, oh, that may be there all day. Easy two for Edie. The Nebraska Cornhusker. Ivy off the bounce. What a pass. And Edie throws it down through the contact. Jaden Ivey, this guy is quick twitch, and when he attracts the help, you got a big target that you're dropping it down to. Seven foot four, Zach Eady. Here comes Ivey. Ivey doing it all himself. Oh boy. Usually a guy that's attacking the rim in transition. Look at him kind of bounce back and forth. It's CJ Wilcher. Rebounded by Frazier. I thought Numa should have hit Edie back in the post and let it post up again. Oh, a rejection by Edie. It knocked out of bounds. Fashion as well. These Alana fans are not liking the calls, but that's a great block. And that's Big Ten basketball. Bosman's with Doc is. Oh, good hands by Ivy. Plumber leaning. Jaden Ivy trying to warm the gym up some beach volleyball. That's a spike right there. It's only got inside. Edie against a triple team. Doesn't matter. He dunks it home. Ivy to Gillis got a little pump fake, and then because they're saying whose house? Our house. So that's what they chant when they've got the game security here at Mackey Arena. Hunter, deep three, and there is the icing on the cake. Try to sell out to take it something away, either doubling the post or really pressing out on the three-point line. you got to try to take away something. Hunter with the shot clock winding down, got the carro. Sufanovic, too deep here. Backing down Brunk. Look at Johnson. 
Johnson, they don't have numbers. He takes it to the rack and Ivy. Incredible. Talk about recovery. Nobody gave up on this. I can go higher, stay longer, and no one's to charge. Boy, both ends of the floor, does he bring some excitement? <sighs> He's got an extra gear that you just don't usually see at the collegiate level. Never heard of Hunter, the senior, guarded by the freshman Branham. Puts it on the deck down to four seconds. Hunter in the corner. Ivy for the win. He got it. He got it. With some major onions. Get them organized. Jaden Ivy, who beat the Buckeyes on a buzzer beater last season in Columbus. Edie gets it back to Ivy. Ivy gets it back with three. Let's it fly, and down it goes. And that'll be the final possession of this first half. Ethan Morton will trigger it in, number 25 in white. Look at that seal. Oh, my! Edie had a seal on Dickinson, and the high-flying Ivy hammer time. Well, how pretty was this, Timmy B? In traffic, Jaden Ivy. Who was a terrific three-point shooter. Frazier chasing Stefanovic, and he got behind him for two. That's now his seventh two in the traveling black. Here's Ivy. The high screen from Edie drives and lays it in. But physically has his way. I mean, this is just too easy. Obviously, a good screen. Zach Edie's going to set as many screens as anybody in the country. No doubt about that. What a lob and what a start. Stefanovic up top for Zach Edie. Didn't settle for a jumper. He got into the paint and got a higher percentage look. Travion Williams gets it to Morton, who lays it in. Man, was that beautiful. Well, look at Travion Williams. He's always looking over his shoulder and hits Morton. I mean, that's a beautiful play. Simmons was in pretty good position, but his head was turned, so he couldn't respond. There are opportunities to make a call like that. Purdue lifts Rutgers defense, and we talked about foot races, and Jaden Ivey just turns the corner. It has been their house. Dominant again. And a highlight to finish. Williams behind the back. <laughs> oh, really? Once. Michigan Great State play. by four, now two. First on the back here. Now watch Ethan Morton just sneak right up here. It's a little screen for the screener action. Eric Hunter over the top. Caleb first with the back. Just making a play on the ball and scoring the rock at the rim. Produced top 25 at preventing offensive rebounds as Stefanovic shot seeking. And that is a huge sign for Purdue. Now here is that pin down for Stefanovic. He's flying off. Davison just a little bit behind. Davison missed. Ivy in a hurry. Pulling up for three. He tied the game! Oh, lethal shot from Ivy. He was going to send us to overtime. I mean, shot making at the highest level. It's Jaden Ivy coming in transit. Rob Finnessy, much like the first game, impacting this one here today. Edie sizing up Durr, who arm bars him. Edie got him deep and missed again. His second one is there! Second most in Purdue history. Boy, this is not a game if you're soft to play in. I mean, Edie going up with the left hand, gets his offensive rebound. And once again, he fails. Ivy, kick out, Hunter checks his feet, shot fake, back up, book it, and he's fouled. Well, Purdue getting out in the open floor. Here's the shot fake, the step aside, Eric Hunter. They're going to say that Seth Lundy grazed his hip. I don't know about the foul, but the shot. Ivy <laughs> puts it back outside. Great players that make impossible passes. Nice cut and pass. And Hunter off the Williams assist. How he delivers the ball. So much fun to play with. Constant moving. He'll find you and a little celebration afterwards. Sharon is caring. Good, good two hands. Oh, no, that's Ivy. Watch out. Behind the back. Up and in. 
<laughs> he's, hurt. he's hurt though. You get the ball to the basket there behind the back, Euro step. I think when he started going behind the back, he didn't see the traffic coming. Right. Lands right on his tailbone. Ooh. Production off the bench for the senior. Turkey stays right with him. Could have saved that one. With two on the shot clock. Stavanovic, a nice little hesitation. Great contest. Splash. Wayne's playing outside right now. He's got to get to the rim. There they got him. Gordon loves, loves that hook now. Oh, look at this oh, pass. Oh, he did oh, it oh, yesterday, oh, too. He's special. Oh, oh, Williams. Williams. Middle Lark is the favorite big in all of college basketball. <laughs> Williams with a little flair like Raph. <laughs> a little magic. And why not? Check and dunk the longer. Pass it to the team big time.